the people behind that shooting are still on the loose, with police telling me the incident was, quote, definitely a shootout. Residents tell me that the lack of suspects has left them scared to be in their homes. I hit the sighting and then go through um, my bathroom and then it went, proceeded to hit my uh, like shelving unit and went through there. Around 11 p.m. on Sunday night, this quiet York County neighborhood was filled with police after a reported shootout in the 300 block of Bra Drive. While no one was hurt, at least two homes and three cars were hit by bullets. Now police are searching for the suspects that left behind more than bullet holes as shock, terror and disbelief now plague this Manchester Township neighborhood. Just still um, in shock and numb and uh, yeah, I'm just just waiting for it to you know hit me right now. One of the homes shot at belongs to Mary, a resident who didn't want to be on camera but says she was watching TV when she heard gunshots. One of the bullets fired went through her home's exterior wall, bathroom wall, and bedroom wall before firing just a foot above where Mary was sitting. I heard um, pop, pop, pop like eight times and it sounded to me like it was coming from the front of the of my home and um, right then and there I just knew it was um, you know good job. Mary says she's now sleeping in her kitchen as she tries to make some sense of the gunfire and the fear it's brought to her life. I'm just scared. Um, I don't think I caught anyone and I just keep thinking why did this happen here? Why? And I know you know, more and more that can, things happen anywhere and it happened here and just really don't feel safe. Any residents with doorbell video or information on the shooting are asked to contact police. Live in York County, McKenna Alexander, WJL News 8. All right.